this video, we're going to talk about the three major strands that contribute to word recognition. I'm Angela Griffith, and I help teachers to create positive literacy experiences for the students that they serve. We're going to spend some time unraveling Scarborough's reading rope. More specifically, we're going to talk about the word recognition domain. If you missed the video on the reading rope, I'll leave a link for you below. So what does word recognition mean? I'm so glad you asked that question. Word recognition is the accurate and fast retrieval of decoded word forms. So let's take a closer look at the three sub skills that are in the word recognition domain. First up, we have phonological awareness. Phonological awareness is the ability to identify and manipulate the sound properties of spoken words. Phonemic awareness is a type of phonological awareness, and the goal of training in phonemic awareness is to establish in the phonological lexicon, otherwise known as phonological memory, mental parking spots, if you will, into which letters can be parked for later recall. I have several videos about phonological awareness. I have some on the screen here and I'll leave them linked for you below as well as several activities that you can incorporate into your classroom today. The next strand or sub skill is decoding, which is the ability to translate a word from print to speech. This includes knowledge of the alphabetic principle and knowledge of the phoneme and grapheme correspondence. Phonemes are the smallest unit of sound and a grapheme represents a phoneme. So a grapheme could be a letter or two, three, or four letters to represent a phoneme or a sound. So the coding is driven by a few things. To decode quickly and accurately, a reader must know something about orthography, which is a written system for representing a language. Decoding is also driven by morphology, the study of meaningful units in a language, and syntax, the arrangement of words in sentences. The last strand or sub-skill in the word recognition domain is sight word recognition. And I can tell you, that does not mean those Dolch and Fry sight word lists. The entire reason that we study words with little ones, the reason that we learn to decode by phonics, is so that we can recognize orthographic patterns. This helps us to develop an automatic recognition of words that we've seen before, which enables us to recall word spellings and writing. Now that's a simplified version. We'll go deeper in another video about sight word recognition. Join me in the next video where we talk about the other domain of the reading rope, language comprehension. <music>